The Ministry of Health and Wellness, today Wednesday, November 25th, 2020, received confirmation of nine new cases of COVID-19. These cases bring the total number of cases diagnosed in country to date to 235. Two of the cases are visitors to St. Lucia, that is case number 231 is a 37-year-old female and case number 232 is a 35-year-old male. They arrived in country on Sunday, November 22, 2020 and required testing for COVID-19 upon arrival. They proceeded to a COVID-19 certified property for quarantine pending the receipt of their results. Upon being confirmed as COVID-19 cases, they were both transferred into the isolation and the contact tracing process for these cases have commenced. The other seven cases are St. Lucia Nationals. Case number 227 is a 43-year-old female from the Castries district. Case number 228 is an 83-year-old male from the Sufre district. Case number 229 is a 56-year-old female from the Grosile district. Case number 230 is a 27-year-old female from the Castries district. Case number 233 is a 29-year-old male from the Castries district. Case number 234 is a 39-year-old male from the Castries district. Case number 235 is a 29-year-old female from the Castries district. All of these individuals, after being assessed and tested for COVID-19, were placed in quarantine by health practitioners while awaiting their results. Epidemiological links have been established for five of these cases. These are case number 227, 230, 233, 234, and 235. The contact tracing team is in the process of investigating the presence of epidemiological links for the other cases. As per protocol, arrangements have been made to place all cases into isolation. These new cases bring the total number of active cases in country to 124. None of these cases currently require critical care and they're all doing well. As we are now in what is traditionally the cold and flu season, the Ministry of Health and Wellness reminds everyone of the importance of building a strong immune system to be able to fight off respiratory illnesses. Be sure to increase your intake of citrus fruits and vegetables and to remain hydrated by drinking water frequently during the day. These habits will assist in building resistance as well as to strengthen the overall health and well-being. It is also important and to be mindful to behave in ways that reduce our exposure to the COVID-19 virus. That is to ensure that you wash your hands often during the day using soap and flowing water, to wear a mask every time you're in public and to ensure it covers both your mouth and your nose. Maintain a distance of six feet between others. Use of bleach solution to sanitize frequently touched services and to avoid contact with other people who have flu-like symptoms. If you're experiencing flu-like symptoms, keep away from others and seek medical care immediately at the closest community respiratory clinic. As usual, the Ministry of Health and Wellness will continue providing information as it becomes available. <music>